will happen to the country now that the president's impeached? That's an excellent question. Well, there are two options. Um, what impeachment is, it is like identifying that an individual has committed a wrong. Um, and that wrong doesn't have to be a criminal act. It could be just something doing something that um, is not in the best interest of the country or not befitting or appropriate for the job that you have. And so now that the House of Representatives has impeached the president, that is um, that body of Congress identifying him in their position, in their view, as to having done a wrong. So it's like being indicted for a crime. It's like being told um, we're going to prosecute you and there will be a trial. So the country right now is no different than the country the day before it was impeached. The president still is in full authority over um, the, the country and still has his full position. Uh, but the next stage will be for the Senate to conduct a trial. And we're a majority of those in the Senate to um, decide that the president um, has committed these wrongs. Um, he could be removed from office. And so that removal um, would be what would um, change things quite a bit. And so then the vice president would become the president. Every reason, we have most reason to think that that would not happen, uh, that there's not going to be a sufficient number of senators uh, to remove the president. But that's an excellent question. How long have you been teaching the Constitution? I've been teaching the Constitution for about 16 years or more. And before that, I was a lawyer and I did civil rights work, and so I litigated constitutional issues. Why did you decide to teach about the Constitution? I decided to teach about the Constitution because I think it's a very important topic. Um, I think all Americans, I wish I could teach constitutional law to people who didn't even go to law school because I think all of us should know something about our Constitution. I think it's um, important if you're going to be a good citizen to know uh, what makes this country a democracy and what keeps us free. And so I find that a very exciting aspect to teaching the Constitution because one of the things we're all experiencing now is why would the framers have decided the president could be impeached? And the reason they did that wasn't to punish the president, but instead to keep us free and to keep us from a president um, acting like a king. And so it's a really unique aspect of law to teach because um, I feel like I'm teaching my students not just what they need to know to pass the bar exam or to be good lawyers, but to be good American citizens. Thank you for your time.